how I structure my eating to stay thin. So I use a very specific weekly eating structure that I use to lose weight and that I've used to maintain my goal weight. And what it is is I split my week into two categories where I eat clean and where I eat for pleasure. Now right now I usually eat Monday through Friday afternoon to eat as clean as I possibly can. Now it doesn't mean I always eat perfectly clean but that's the intention. And then on the weekend it's more about eating for pleasure. Now there's a couple reasons why this is so effective. First off, it's not the diet mindset where you're just going to cut out all the bad foods forever because that triggers a feeling of deprivation. So it's a lot easier when you know that you're just putting off the pleasurable foods for a week or a couple days and you know you can eat them on the weekend. So that's the first thing. The second thing is that you know you're going to eat for pleasure on the weekend and it allows you to start to learn how to eat in a way that's pleasurable but you're not going crazy with it. So I like to say that the weekend is kind of minimizing the damage, right? I'm going to eat for pleasure but I'm not going wild with it. So I'm learning how to eat responsibly when I'm eating for pleasure, which is really valuable because again, with dieting, it's all or nothing. And most of the times you're either doing perfect or you're doing nothing at all. And so this is a way to practice eating kind of in that gray zone. And the third thing that's most important of all is that every Monday I practice getting back on track. And this is the most important thing of all because when it comes to mastering your weight, the number one skill you need to learn is how to get back on track quickly. When you start thinking in a longer time frame, when you get out of the diet mindset of just thinking it'll be perfect for a couple of weeks or months, and you start thinking, how can I live at my goalie for the rest of my life? What you need to understand is that you're never going to be perfect. So you need to increase your skill at getting back on track quickly when you do get off track. And so with this eating structure, it helps me with all three of those things. And if you start eating this way, I think you're going to find that it feels a lot better and it sets you up for long-term success.